Have you ever wondered what a transistor is and why it's so important? Well, let's embark on a journey of discovery together. A transistor, in its simplest terms, is a tiny switch that controls the flow of electricity. It's like the traffic cop of electronics, directing the flow of electrical current, deciding which path it should take, and when. This might sound pretty basic, but trust me, it's a game-changer in the world of electronics. Imagine a city without traffic cops. Chaos, right? That's what an electronic device would be like without transistors. They are the unsung heroes, silently working behind the scenes in almost every electronic device you can think of, from your smartphone to your microwave. So next time you're texting a friend or heating up dinner, remember, you've got a tiny army of transistors to thank for that. In essence, a transistor is a tiny switch that controls the flow of electricity, a vital component in almost every electronic device. Now, you might be curious, how does a transistor work? Well, think of a transistor as a tiny gatekeeper controlling the flow of electricity in a circuit. When the gate is open, electricity flows through. When it's closed, the flow stops. That's the role of a transistor, a fundamental building block in the world of electronics. This magic is enabled by a handy class of materials called semiconductors, typically silicon. A transistor is made up of three layers of these semiconductors. The middle layer, the gate, decides whether the transistor is on or off. When we apply a small voltage to the gate, it allows a larger current to flow from one side of the transistor to the other. This simple on-off functionality is the basis of binary code, the language of computers and electronics. So, a transistor works by controlling electrical current, acting as an on-off switch and making our electronic devices function. You may not know this, but there are actually several types of transistors. Yes, indeed. Just like with ice cream, there's more than one flavor to choose from. But in our case, the two main types of transistors are the bipolar junction transistors, or BJTs for short, and the field effect transistors, also known as FETs. Now let's imagine BJTs as the diligent worker bees of the transistor world. They're always on the go, controlling current flow through the use of both positive and negative charges. This makes them versatile and reliable, a true jack-of-all-trades. On the other hand, think of FETs as the laid-back surfer dudes. They're all about going with the flow, controlling current by varying the width of a channel along which charge carriers flow. This makes them ideal for applications where you need a high input impedance. But don't let their chill demeanor fool you. FETs are just as essential as BJTs in the grand scheme of things. They're often used in amplifiers and switching devices, making them an integral part of our everyday electronics. In essence, these two types of transistors, though different in their working mechanisms, work hand in hand to control the flow of electrical current in a circuit. Their differences are what make them perfect for different applications, adding diversity to the world of electronics. Whether it's a bipolar junction transistor or a field effect transistor, each one plays a critical role in the world of electronics. Indeed, their role is as vital as the heart in a living organism, pumping life into our beloved gadgets. So, why are transistors so crucial in electronics? Well, let's dive into that. Transistors have essentially revolutionized the world of technology. They've made it possible for us to create devices that are smaller, faster, and far more efficient than anything that came before them. Think of a transistor as the very heart of your electronic devices. They regulate current or voltage flow and act as a switch for electronic signals. This switch-like behavior is what makes digital electronics possible. Every bit of information, every one and zero that zips around inside your computer or smartphone is controlled by millions of tiny transistors switching on and off. Not only that, but transistors have also enabled the miniaturization of electronic components. Back in the day, vacuum tubes did the job that transistors do now, but they were bulky, less reliable, and consumed more power. Transistors, on the other hand, are minute, reliable, and power-efficient. This has allowed for the development of compact devices that we see today, from smartphones and laptops to smartwatches, and even advanced medical equipment. The importance of transistors also extends to power electronics. They are key in converting and controlling electrical power, which is essential for renewable energy technologies, electric vehicles, and power management in our homes and industries. 
Without transistors, we wouldn't have the advanced electronics we rely on daily. They truly are the building blocks of modern technology. So, to sum it up, transistors are the fundamental building blocks of modern electronics. They control the flow of electricity, acting as a switch or an amplifier. With three main types, the bipolar junction, field effect, and the junction gate field effect transistors, each has unique capabilities. Their importance cannot be overstated, as they're the heart of every device we use daily. So next time you use your smartphone or laptop, remember the tiny but mighty transistor that makes it all possible. Stay tuned to Fix Flare Tech, where we continue to delve into the fascinating world of technology and engineering. This is MQ Joshi, signing off until our next tech adventure.